How about a quick tour of the facilities to refresh your memory? Let's start with your living quarters. Follow me. citizens of New Los Angeles. Good day. This is your Director General, Maurice Chausson. Today, I once again come to you with news I am truly delighted to share. Yesterday, we repatriated ten more White Whale crew members. These fellow pioneers will rejoin our ranks as citizens of NLA, bringing with them skills and know-how that will bolster our ability to survive and indeed flourish here in our new home. This, of course, is only the latest success in our continuing efforts. Director General? Since when? For the rescue and recovery Two of days ago, ma'am. brothers and sisters. I stand here truly... From political aid to Director General in just a few weeks. At this rate, he'll be Emperor by next month. For a better NLA and a better Irina? Tomorrow. Gwyn? Nice work out there, ma'am. Right. Introductions. Irina Akulov, Gwyn Evans. This one of the survivors, Colonel? The survivor. I only found a single pod intact at Starfall Basin. Wait, what? What happened to ten more crew members? Come on, seriously? Shosan was never one to let the truth get in the way of a good speech. Still, every last survivor counts. You can call me Arena. I'm with the Interceptors. Me too. Same division. You can call me Mr. Evans. Or just Gwyn. The three of us were in the Coalition forces together. Specifically, the Special Operations Heavy Armor Training Unit. A.K.A. the Skeleton Crew. I was a colonel, and Arena a lieutenant. Gwyn was a more recent recruit. Of course, I keep telling them we don't need those old ranks anymore now that we're here. You're still colonel to me, ma'am. No reorg will ever change that. And that's not about chain of command, either. It's about respect. You've earned it. And the award for best ass kiss goes to... Uh, <clears throat> Well, I'd remind you both the ma'ams aren't necessary, if I thought you'd listen. All right, ma'am. We should be getting back to work. Until next time, Colonel. Right. We should be going, too. The administrative district isn't far. That's where you'll be calling home. For now, anyway.
Look, I know what exhaust smells like, and it was exhaust in the cockpit. Just check the ductwork, would you? Oh, I'm checking. I just seriously doubt... Hey, look at that. The intake exhaust bypass is reversed. Oh man, it's a good thing I caught that. You caught that? You're the one who cleared me to fly! Everything okay? It's not like you to flub a flight check, Lynn. Good thing you had a rugged pilot like Doug at the controls. Oh, hey, Elma. How'd it go out there? And would this be one of the you-know-whos? Cool. I'm Lynn Lee Koo, mechanic and top all-around fix-it gal for Blade. Uh, yeah. Well, that, uh, doesn't usually happen. We know it doesn't, Lynn. Look, I know what you're thinking. But believe me, young as she may look, and yes, she is young, she's actually one of our top talents. Most of the time, that is. Most of the time. Anyway, you guys heading back to the barracks? Yeah. Why do you ask? As long as you're here, why don't I take you on the transport? It's a great way to see the city. I'll give you the grand tour. That sounds like a great idea. All right, Doug, I think that'll be all for today. You can clean up here and dock the skell. What? Don't mind the exhaust. I'll take care of it tomorrow. Don't mind it? Wait, why am I cleaning up your mess in the first place? Lynn! Lynn!